I don't know that we can actually give crisp, watertight, no response answers. For these issues, I'm not sure you can do that. Philosophers have worked this through for centuries. How would we know that a God of infinite wisdom could not have loving reasons for allowing pain to continue? Every religion was me chasing after God and the message of Jesus was God chasing after me. The Massachusetts Supreme Court, which is right to our south here, decided to legalize same-sex marriage. They came to me and said, well, what do you think? The Bible is full of the supernatural, from Old Testament stories like the Red Sea being parted to the New Testament stories of Jesus healing people or walking on the water and the pivotal story of Jesus rising to life from the dead. Does religion create war? There is a link between religion and violence, sure. Uh, there's also a link between politics and violence. There's a link between land and violence, and so on, right? Anything people feel passionate about, they get violent about. Adolf Hitler, Joseph Stalin, Mao Zedong, a hundred million people lost their lives, and they were not motivated by religion. If something truly is true, then other things must be false. Contradictions cannot be true. And all world religions have contradictions in them. They don't say the same thing. My hope is that a genuinely open-minded person who has key issues of faith and belief can actually watch the series and get to the end and go, it is reasonable to be someone who believes in the supernatural, who believes in God, and may want to consider what that will mean for their life.